it's never good when people lose their jobs, but uh, this is war. And unfortunately, there are casualties in war. And uh, I went to his page to check dude out, you know, obviously a DEI hire. Uh, nah, cuz. Hold on. <laughs> nah, cuz. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Nah, cuz. It's no way. It's, it's no way. Nah, cuz. Ain't no way. Hold on, hold on. Hop. <laughs> nah cuz this ain't this ain't real this is ai nah cuz nah cuz nah cuz nah cuz nah, this is this is fake this is not real this is this is not a real thing nah cuz guys <laughs> This nigga, listen, I'm gonna refrain from nah, cuz this. Before we get into our main topic, we got until we get before we get into the main course, we gotta eat our vegetables. We gotta eat our vegetables. It's a lot of Marvel news coming out uh, later on today. We gotta talk about, uh, uh, um, you know, Disney is just whew, it ain't looking good for Disney out here. It's stock dropping, flops everywhere. God damn. It, it's just it's just not a good look. And so, but there is a lot of you know. Uh, uh, news discussing where Marvel's headed. Uh, there's discussion about Dwayne Johnson to portray Apocalypse mm -hmm. in the MCU. Listen, first of all, Apocalypse is one of my favorite uh, uh, villains. I I'm a big fan of villains. I love, um, I love, you know, the idea of The Rock playing uh, Apocalypse. I understand some people don't like that. Okay, that's cool. Kevin Feige says he likes playing the underdog. Uh, I prefer to be able to surprise and exceed expectations. I actually agree with that. Uh, cause right now the expectations are in the gutter. So when you, ex when you exceed the expectations, you get things like X-Men 97. I done told y'all several times X-Men 97 is, 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 is that crack. And I still recommend for people to go and see that. You know what I'm saying? God damn. All right. Also, we got Ryan Coogler, uh, being confirmed, uh, uh, for Black Panther 3, which I'm hoping, I mean, recast T'Challa. Okay, do something with T'Challa. I don't want to see no more Shuri. I'm sorry, you know what I'm saying. I'm I'm done with it. I'm 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 I don't want to see uh uh her no more. Um, get it out of my face. I'm done with it. Okay, get out of here. All right. Uh, recast T'Challa and do what you got to do. But they're also looking at Ryan Coogler to um direct X Men. And listen, I love Ryan Coogler. I love his story. I love where he came from. And, and how he did it, and I think he did it the right way. I do not think Ryan Coogler is woke, um, but a lot of people are mad about Black Panther too. Listen, he could not control the fact that Chadwick Boseman left us. Okay, so I'm gonna give him the benefit of the doubt. Um, but bring the, bring Bo DeMeo back now. I don't know what what strange you gotta uh, pull, but bring him back. But anyway, we gotta get into the main course. Okay, we gotta get into the main course. All right, it is an absolute bloodbath over at Kotaku. And these community managers, Kotaku, uh, according to Grums, Kotaku has laid off four more staff. One of whom, one of whom wrote the Stellar Blaze. Eve is the hottest when she is not revealing everything. Uh oh, it ain't looking good. Before we get into it, guys, man, we are so close. We're we are so close, guys, to nine thousand subscribers. There we go. That, this is where we at. All right, make sure you hit the like button, subscribe to the channel. 
If you have not done so already, consider becoming a channel member and, be join and join the Shadow Band Army. We have watch parties every Friday and Saturday night. Me and my girl Jess, we react into the latest movies and TV shows. Uh, uh, and then additionally, uh, make sure y'all are following me on Twitter. I just hit 1,300 uh, followers on Twitter. So shouts out to y'all. All right. Anyway, so let's go ahead and get back into it. So, yeah, uh, uh, Levi Winslow is one of the many or well, not the many, but uh, one of the four people that got fired. OK, Kotaku, Kotaku, it, it, it won't it won't be long. And I know this dude was as soon as he found out he got fired after writing that article. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> God damn. Ooh, boy, it ain't looking good. It ain't looking good at all. Uh, 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 who else? Apparently this person. This person right here. Okay. All right. This guy right here. You know, well, Geo Media laid me off along with three other video folks, all of whom were my good friends. It was a turbulent ride with a shitty ending. But despite the ups and downs, I'm proud of what I've done. Now I'm going to go cry. Oh, Lord have mercy. Let's go ahead and pour one out from Mr. Levi uh, here. What more do you want from me? You <laughs> stupid. Can flush his Kotaku tenure ship right on down the drain. You better learn how to squabble next time. Teach your man how to squabble. <laughs> Get that trigger next time, nigga. <laughs> Teach your man how to squabble next time, man. He goes, thank you to uh, uh, thank you everyone. The kind words have been heartwarming. I'm unfortunately in internal. I'm unfortunately internalizing the layoff, blaming myself for my incompetence or whatever but life will go on and so will i i'm taking a step back from games and putting the pin down for a while well that's how you should well first of all heartwarming hot heartwarming i'm sorry that's a little bit sweet i don't know, I don't know what you're talking about uh let's uh but he, he's taking it on the chin uh he blamed his own incompetence i don't know listen i'm not familiar with levi winslow i don't know if he's one of the the infamous kotaku journalists that we've been roasting over the past few years but I mean, I like the fact that he took it on the chin and, you know, uh, it, it's never good when people lose their jobs, but uh, this is war. And unfortunately, there are casualties in war. And uh, I went to his page to check dude out, you know, obviously a DEI hire. Uh, nah, cuz. Hold on. <laughs> nah, cuz. Hold on, hold on. Nah, cuz. It's no way. It's, it's no way. Nah, cuz. Ain't no way. Hold on, hold on. Hop. Nah, cuz. This ain't, this ain't real. This is AI. Nah, cuz. Nah, cuz. Nah, cuz. Nah, cuz. Nah, cuz. This is, this is fake. This is not real. This is this is not a real thing. Nah, cuz. Guys. <laughs> this nigga. Listen, I'm gonna refrain from Nah, cuz. This wish you <laughs> i wish you well wishes um good luck out there good luck but you know they didn't fire <laughs> but you know they didn't fire who we need her to, who we need them to fire and you know who i'm talking about 
You know she's the final boss of it all. Okay. And on the day that she gets fired, we're going to be dancing on them. We're going to be dancing on them. You know how I go. You know how I go. Kotaku, you better get rid of her. You better get rid of her. Anyway, they're not the only ones getting fired. They're not the only ones getting fired. Who, who, where is it? Where is it? Okay. Here's another one. Community managers feeling the heat too. Uh-oh. Nigga. We got Hell Divers has fired Discord community manager Spitz who inflamed the community with his flip defense of PSN, which he later walked back. All roles removed, and he cites asking players to do negative reviews as the reason. Thanks to Real Jack for the screen caps. Has the cleanup begun? Purple was also demoted but not fired after falsely accusing me of crimes. Okay? This is the message. I appreciate all the support and I appreciate even more that everyone can uh, play the game again without restrictions. I knew I was taking a risk with what I said about refunding and changing reviews. I stand by it. It was my job to represent the community and that's what I did. Taking the rest of the day off, not feeling super well. Love all. That ain't good. God damn. Okay. Unfortunately, um, this guy got fired. Uh, you can see he's no longer a community manager. Uh, he got fired for pretty much telling people to go and, you know, downvote the game, uh, go and do some bad reviews. That's pretty much what he got fired for, which is why I'm not going to really celebrate his loss. Um, it's that Baconator chick that, that, um, it's that, it's that Baconator chick here. Here she is. The Baconator chick. Um, you know what I'm saying? This is her. That's who we really need up out of there. Big Shirley. I'm addicted to the good yeah God damn. you know what i'm saying so what we need to get the uh catherine bacon uh up out of there and uh and we'll be square you know what i'm saying um and then and there was another person who uh let me see let me go uh grum's page who allegedly accused him of let me see of uh, sa uh let me see let me find it let me find it let me find it let me find it mm -mm. Mm -mm. hold on y'all i'm almost there is this it? nope that's not it i should have brought it up there's the baconator is this the okay here it is here it is purple squid squidgian this is the person who allegedly got demoted God damn. All right. <clears throat> uh, uh, this person says, Flash Gordon says, you defend a company that will leave this game and you in a ditch. And this and, and purple responded, someone who uh, 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 spicefully assaulted many people he worked with, lost his position as CEO, now is a far right influencer who had people attack more than one of our community managers and their families. That guys that is a stupid none of Come it's on. true none of it's true none of that it's is an absolute true. lie yes they made it up they lie they lie <laughs> and so because of it you have been demoted uh 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 let's go ahead and sing you a sad oh, song in the world's smallest oh, violin let me play a sad song for you so, the world's smallest violin it's done time to get a real job all right welcome to hell welcome to hell welcome to hell Y'all let me know what y'all think down in the comments. Oh, fuck you, fuck you. Fuck you, fuck you. 